Let's do a simple demonstration of using Secure Shell and Secure Copy between two virtual machines, an Ubuntu machine and a CentOS machine. So first, from the Ubuntu machine, let's try to log into the CentOS machine. Well, first I need to know the IP address of both machines. So I can do that with IP, and I'll say brief to get a condensed output. Um, ADDR for address show. And I can see my address on this machine is 172.16.249.133. I'll do the same command on this CentOS machine. And you see the address is the same except for the last byte or octet, which is 129. So first let's log into the CentOS machine from Ubuntu. I do SSH student at 172.16.249.129 and it's the first time I'm doing this so it wants to make sure that I'm authentic so I say yes and now I have to give the password and it's fine I'm on the CentOS machine as you can see from the prompt now in that command I really didn't have to give student that because we're using student account on both machines but it never hurts to do that so let me exit now let's do from the CentOS machine let's copy over a directory using SCP over to the Ubuntu machine so let me do SCP-R for recursive to get the whole directory and everything underneath it uh, and this time uh, I won't Okay, so home student, I'll copy the home student directory. I won't bother saying student that, I'll just give the address 172.16249.133 and I'll put it in the temp directory. Once again, it wants to make sure that it's authentic, so I'll say yes. And once again, I have to give the password and it's copied over. And if I go over to the Ubuntu machine and I look in the temp directory, I'll see the account is now there, the directory is now there. So that's all there is to do a pretty simple demonstration of using Secure Shell and Secure Copy.